my producers, and welcome back from the weekend. Well, sunny, professional, but probably a little impatient today for the producers. The moon starts in Aquarius, so emotional focus is on career and legacy. So Taurus, you're sensitive about your career. You're sensitive about how legacy is going. This might be your children, because they are your legacy. This might be the overall relationship with someone in your career, an employee or uh, a boss or a supervisor. But realize that's just your emotional sensitivity. The learning today is the sun. We're at 29 degrees of sun in Gemini. The bulls all month long have worked on upgrading what we call soul capital, your value state of awareness, what you value and why, and what that turns into is abundance, right? God, universe always matches your hand. But we have to be good at how we build value. There can't be holes there, there can't be doubts. And today, you might get pulled in the old doubt, you might get pulled in the old self-esteem, you might be pulled in the old money worries, all apply to this transit. And if you get pulled into the old, really just find out why. That's the point of the test. Emotion is high today, ego is amped up today, and it's really a test of how, what, how you've learned, and maybe just to see if there's maybe something you didn't see. But there's also a simultaneous test. Mars at 29 degrees Taurus. And the 20th degree is the tested degree, even if it's including Mars. So as you're being tested with your ability to stay confident and own your soul capital, you're also being tested on your ego, which you've developed so far, and this new personality that's kind of breaking with Jupiter in chapter one. So it's a duality test, soul capital and ego, and that test might be lit up or the fuse may be a career or legacy issue. Now, for all this, here to help is Julie Zipper with Meditation Vibration going live today. Julie's gonna snap back to last Wednesday's lunar eclipse in Gemini, what you're getting tested on right now, and kind of give you a little depth of perception using meditation. It's a great way to kind of uh, see where you failed the test if you failed, or maybe learn more about why you passed. Check out Julie. She's live everywhere the garden is blooming today. All right, my bulls, good luck with your test, and I'll see you tomorrow when we get to the zero degree. Until then, let love be. So God.